know what today is, right? It's Saturday. That means one thing. Amazon Customer Return Electronics Day. So in front of me, I have another large Amazon Customer Return Electronics mystery box. I bought a total of 30 of these boxes. That was a ton of product. And we got a lot of videos coming up. So hopefully these electronic ones are going to be incredible. So my price for these were around 220 shipped out the door. So hopefully I get like triple my money back. Maybe over to 700. That's my goal. They usually say you can get usually around 750 ish, maybe as high as a thousand. I've gotten some boxes where I did get over a thousand dollars. I actually ha I had one just recently that I barely cracked a hundred dollars of profit. So some boxes can be really bad, some can be mediocre, and some are just freaking home runs. Ready to do this? Let's see what is in this Amazon mystery box. All electronic liquidations. Mostly the customer returns, and a lot of this stuff is going to be brand new still. Come on, knife. That needs sharpened really bad. Here we go. Give you the first sneak peek. What do we see? It's electronics. Give you a little, little, little sneak peek. That's what I'm looking at right there. See anything good in that box? Let me set this down, and we'll start digging. So some of the stuff I'll look up on eBay or Amazon, kind of see sold prices. Some stuff I'll just guesstimate from like what I've sold stuff for in the past. Here you go, first thing, this is an off-brand called a Cross Tour. It's a very, it's a much, much cheaper, kind of like an off-brand GoPro. Not very expensive. It's like $20, $25. And it is used, missing all the accessories, box, everything's missing. Let's see, what is this? DV cam? Huh. 4K Ultra HD little camera. It works. That's kind of cool. How much is this thing worth, I wonder? Let me look this thing up, see if I can find something about this. I don't see an actual brand, but I'll see if I can find something. Okay, I've honestly looked on eBay for probably the past like five minutes, scrolling through, and I don't see an actual name brand. This it's it says DV Cam, but that's just a very like a generic name. On the camera itself, I don't see a brand on it. DV DVC Digital Voice Camera. I don't know. It's just going to take more research on my part. It's probably not crazy expensive, but it does say it is 4K Ultra HD camera. It's very small, compact. I'm kind of interested to actually try to see if it actually takes decent videos or not. It might. You never know. Screen looks good on it, though. I mean, like just seeing like the actual like screen on this side looks pretty solid. But I have to do more research on this. Try to find something. I'll estimate down below with the running total. Approximately what I find on it. I also might just keep this for business use because obviously I'm in the business of recording stuff. So it's never a bad thing to have, you know, a, a fifth or tenth extra camera just because. Here we go. Air Intelligent Wireless. Like we got some... Not still tape, but these are just going to be um, earphones. Pretty cheap. We got some more earphones called Wave Earbuds. This one is still factory sealed though. That does help out resale price on that. But I think I said earlier, maybe, most everything is box be for sale in my eBay store. There'll be a direct link down below to my eBay store right now with over like 1,400 items available for sale right now. So make sure you check it out. Uh, 25, 30 bucks. Not crazy expensive, but I mean, a little bit of money, right? Let's see, we have a two controller charging stands for Xbox X. Off brand is so probably not very expensive, 10, 15 bucks. Oh, we got another one of these things. A knockoff Nintendo NES Classic. This is the bootleg version. It is a bootleg. Honestly, they work just fine, but it is bootleg. We don't sell those because it's, you know, it's copyright infringement to do with Nintendo. I don't want I don't want to mess with Nintendo and their lawyers. 
selling like bootleg stuff like that. Oh, here we got a Razer Basilix Hyperspeed mouse. No box, no nothing. Probably at least 20 bucks, I bet, right? Let's see. Oh, he's one of these, these little speakers. Tiny, tiny speakers. We've been selling these on eBay for around 30 bucks or so, give or take. I can like a little, little tweeter kind of a thing. Little small speakers. They sell kind of slowly, but they do sell eventually. Like I said, around like 30 bucks or so. Oh, we actually might hold on to this. We have one of these in, in our garage and um, it fell off of the shelf a couple days ago and it broke. So we actually need to replace this. It's, it's the exact same one. Might actually have to switch those out. But yeah, that's uh, 25, 30 bucks. What is this? Did we just get a, we, we just got a phone. Yes, we did. We just got a freaking cell phone. Wow, it still has like the original film on it too. I think it just got a brand new phone. It's open box item, but it still has the original film on the phone. Hold on, let me look something up. It's the Samsung Galaxy A50. Hopefully this thing's a home run item. I haven't gotten a phone in a pout for a long time. So on Amazon, this is the Samsung Galaxy A50, 64 gigabyte, unlocked by Samsung. It looks like it's literally open box item. Everything is still all wrapped up on it. It's probably never been turned on, but it sells open box on eBay. If it has the original box and everything, it can go for around 150 bucks, as high as 170. But 150 for this one is actually a pretty fair assessment. <laughs> around, around 150 bucks. Nice. Open box item, looks like it is like, it's literally in brand new condition, just open box item. So that is fantastic. We got an awesome, we got a freaking, a pretty nice cell phone. That's awesome right there, that's exciting. That's kind of stuff you love to get out of these pallets. Stuff kind of, kind of like that, stuff you don't expect. Let's see, Surf, looks like we got a cable modem. Yeah, we got a cable modem. Still has the original like uh, factory seals on it too. Aris surfboard. Let me look this thing up. See how much this sells for. I'm not too sure value this item. Look like this sells open box item for maybe about twenty five dollars in that condition. It's not bad. I'll take it. Okay, we've got a. Oh, we just have a cheaper like a webcam for for your computer. Not very expensive. Ten fifteen bucks. Strong airflow, a clip fan. This is everybody needs, right? A clip fan. This will probably go into our garage sale this summer for like $15, I bet. Let's see. I'm peeking. We have an Orbi. Netgear Orbi wall plug satellite. Orbi? How much does an Orbi sell for? I don't, I'm not too sure. Pre-owned? This thing's like 75 to $100 pre-owned condition without the box as it sits. I had no idea. So as low as like 75 bucks for this item, for the Orbi. Wow, did not expect that. Okay, I'll take that. Let's see what we got. Three pack solar panel charger. Solar panel charger. I don't see a barcode on this for you to scan. I guess it's a uh, a charger for your outdoor security cameras. Hey, that's not bad either. Open box item for this is like sixty to seventy five dollars. Brand new is like one fifty, but open box item sixty to seventy five bucks for this. Not bad. Here we go. Next we have Samsung buds. Some earphones. They are in there and both there. Samsung Buds. These actually sound very, very good for the price point. They're like around $40 used condition. They actually sound fabulous. If you want some cheaper quality earphones that sound good, the Samsung Buds Plus are actually very, very good quality. We'll follow it up right here with some AirPods. You heard that right. AirPods with the charging case. 
So if this thing, if it's all in there, this is about a hundred dollar item right here. There's the case and got them. Both are in there, but there's a hundred dollars for the AirPod like version two with the charging case. Nice, nice. This is gonna be a good box, I think. I'm seeing quite a few items here. They're like 150, 100, 75, 75. Yeah, it's a good box. It's a good one. Panasonic home phone, loose in packaging. A lot of these home phones I've sell 25, 30 bucks. Pretty much, yeah, it's not very expensive. Ooh, Fitbit. Fitbit Charge 2. Nice. So in this box, we've got an Apple AirPods, Samsung Buds, a Samsung Galaxy brand new cell phone, freaking a Fitbit. There's some Google items coming up here in just a second. We actually have some good stuff in this box. This one has some good quality in it. Good stuff. So Fitbit Charge 2 open box item on average around 60 bucks on average as high as 75 that's not bad 60 to 75 dollars in that range for that item that's a good one we have a cisco cap with clean air it's been opened up before let's take a little glance it's in this box it's been retaped by somebody else Cisco's usually like, was it like home, like a Wi Fi routers, I think? In Cisco. We have this. This is Cisco Air Cap. This is what you see like in businesses. They put up onto the ceiling that helps push the Wi Fi signal throughout the building, I think it is. This actually might be pretty good value right here. Well, I had to look this thing up on eBay. This might be, I don't know how much this thing sell for, but. You see these in like businesses a lot. You see them up on the ceilings pushing the Wi-Fi. This is kind of like a part of a kind of like a mesh network actually. Looking on Amazon, this sells new for 48 bucks. If it was brand new. Open box item, probably 30 to 35, I bet. Probably. The last two things I'll pull them both. Oh, no, we have three things left still. Oh, we have an off-brand smartwatch. Just it's it's a cheapie. It'll be garage sale. Nest a thermostat. It probably still has the factory seal on it too. They usually do. Yep, it does. It has the factory seal on it. And they usually sell for around 50 bucks. Right now we have, I think around like 40 of these available because I just buy an entire liquidation box. It was nothing but these. So we have a whole bunch of those available right now for sale. Here we go, last item in this box. We've got the Google, what's this thing called? Nest Wi-Fi router. We've had these things several times. I'm looking at my eBay store right now while I'm gabbing to see if we actually have any of these left or not. I'm not too sure if we do. We did have like, we had several of these available just recently, but we might have actually sold them all. But looking on uh, eBay right now, my actual eBay store that you, you can actually can go to yourself, drop it down below to the eBay store. Looks like now we actually are sold out of these. We don't have any left. Uh, let's see what they've sold for. The Google Nest Wi-Fi routers. Got 60 out of it there. Here a couple weeks ago, we sold this one for 45, sold one for 60, sold one for 55. So we sold for 45, 55, and 60. To take the average, $55 for this. We'll have one available again, but we're now we're sold out, but we got one more in stock. So that will move pretty quickly. A lot of the Google stuff does sell pretty quickly. Like I said, right now we have over 40 of this kind of nest available for sale right now. Make sure you check out our eBay store if you want to pick one up. Um, yeah, this was a good box. Google, Fitbit, Samsung, Apple. This was a solid box. A lot of good stuff in this box. Very happy with this. So hopefully you enjoyed this. I had a lot of fun. This will be profitable. You already know the total down below of what the estimate potential selling total is. It's, it's at least a triple up, if not higher than a triple up. 
maybe $800. That'd be awesome if it was. I don't know if it's that high though, but it'd be great if it was. So if you enjoyed this video, if you would, go down there, click that subscribe button. I actually upload this channel every single day. I have not missed any uploads in almost four years now. So you can come back here every single day to watch brand new free content. See you next time.